Hello, dear students. Today we are going to learn how to find the area of irregular shape by the help of uh, counting the square method. So let us see how we do this. Here you can see that uh, we have drawn a square and uh, this square will be working as the measurement unit. So here we assume that area of this square is one square unit. Now how we use it? What we do is we divide the given shape into number of parts by joining the dots and we see that we are able to see some of the pieces which are making a square and some pieces are making half of a square. Just observe closely. Yes. So here you can see that we have one, two, three, here four, five, then six, then seven, eight, nine, then ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen complete squares in this shape and two pieces are left. Let us see if we join these two pieces, whether we get a square or not. So for that, we will do a little bit of verification. So let us see how we work on it. So here uh, you can see that I have taken this shape and color it. And we have made the replica of it and place it somewhere. Fine. Now we will be taking the remaining piece. Let us see this one. Color it. Make its replica. And try to see if we combine these two, do we get a square or not? Yes, we got a complete square. So this is representing half of a square. Okay. So here, now tell me what is the area of the given shape? 14 plus 1. That is 15 square units. I hope it is clear to you. Now let us make another shape. And you are going to tell me what is its area. Quickly count the number of complete squares and then half squares and then tell me what is its area. So you can see that by joining the dots we can divide this shape into number of parts and see how many complete squares are there. Yes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and then by joining these two we get 1 square so that makes it 6. By joining these two we get another square that means 7 and a half. So the area of this shape is 7.5 square units. So this area of this shape is 7.5 square units. I hope it is clear to you.